So I'm with Regina, the author of this book, and she's a legend in the root community, but you're so much more than just a root supplement, a lady, and you've had an experience, and I've read a little bit of the chapter. Um, so I guess my question is, you said that your ex-partner loved animals, um, and you felt that was a bit fake. I think it is not a fake. These, um, I think, reptiles or whatever they are, or zombies, however you call them, yeah. they are really nice with animals. I cannot get this together because it, it's just so strange. Because of you, they are never nice. They are no, all they always cool, like and they do this and that. You yeah. get other color of eyes. Do you know what I think? You know, I, I think they're trying to confuse you because hmm? they don't like humans or animals or anything. But to make you think they're human, they pretend they like something else. Whether that be other people, like women, in your case, or also animals. Because if you think about it, someone that loves animals is empathetic. Yes. Unless they're lying that they love animals. Do you know it what I mean? Be. Yes, and actually, it could be. Yes, to be honest, it might be all right. Your ex-partner, to be honest, my brother, they don't just not love them, they actually do. If they give them a the chance, no one's watching, they'll kick the animals. Because that brings them joy to hurt other creatures. Because that's, that's a creature with a soul. So they'd often kick and abuse the animal, not even love it, they, hate on it. Yeah, they feel better if you feel pain, what they are doing to you, huh, then yeah. they are happy. Yes. This is something yeah. very, very special to them. That's and true. this is, yeah. you, if you are, you are a human, a loving person, you cannot get these pieces together. Yeah. It is un unbelievable what they are doing and you yeah. you always look to get the two things of the net together, you will never get it. No. Never, never ever. You you are not having these these connections in your head, what they have. You will not not never ever no. believe that. No. That this could happen. And we said before but the last me the main message in your book basically is when you spot them, recognize what they are and don't run away. Don't, don't try and fight, don't play with fire, because I think they win. They, if you give them what you want, if you take them on, yes. you fight them in the you, same you way. Have to, you have to, to realize that you are like a human being, and if you get this in your mind again, then you can stand up and get out of this cage. They put you in the cellar in the cage, you are there with uh, freezing, uh, not realizing that you are a very wonderful human being. You don't think that from yourself. They make you that small, like that. You you just fit in, in this, and you have to to realize that this is not your place. You have to realize, there. leave them, and then then you become powerful. Because often they wake people up. They woken me up. They woken you up. Yes. And then you become empowered to share your life with other people. But I woke up at the time I got through. I have been completely away. Yes. on shadows yeah. in my hand. And with these products, I have been able yeah. to open up my eyes and see what happened around me. Yeah. And I don't like to have this anymore. And then step by step, I got uh, to react and not taking anything from him. In the meantime, he had stolen all my money, all my jewelry and so on. But I know that and I did not do anything against him because I was on the run to just not to kill him because I'm not killing anybody, even if he tries it with me and others. But I want only to get rid of him. I, he has to get out of my life forever. Yeah. But it's not so easy because there are many things that are connected to this to situations. You go somewhere, if I go to an airport, I think, okay, I have been in the airport with this uh, Monk House and I call him because of his life. The memories, you had the yeah. same memories in the same places. Oh, yes, this God. is all I've been coming this back. Process. Yeah, so I've quickly, I know we're making this long, but I've been through this process because we've assumed that human like us so we've had memories and connections and love. And even when we, basically it's a process. Yes. You don't overnight make him into what he actually is, which is dead inside. You yeah. have all of these to unconnect. And yeah. it's, it's, it takes time. Yeah. Same yes. my brother, it's taken yeah. me a long time to disconnect, yeah. to realize that yeah. he's not yeah, this. You have to, you find out that they don't re they really don't have a heart. They don't, they, yeah. they don't ha no. they have a stone, a rock, whatever inside. There's is no heart. No. It's just feeding to get the blood around, but no yeah. feeling, nothing. Yeah. And no soul as well. Yeah. 
they are um, like really like zombies and yeah. normally you feel sad for him because he wants you uh, to feel sad he, yes. they want to they play on the sadness yes this they is play a, on it. Yes, like, a, like a vampire like an energy vampire yes an energy, vampire. energy vampire this is a good idea i could have taken it there but <laughs> i'm going to take i, I think it. me and regina should write a book together maybe i can share the yes. story of my brother um, yes you I, i'm scared because it's a bit um People won't believe me, some of the things I can yeah. say. I mean, the extreme levels of things he done sound ridiculous. Yeah. 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 I can, it's true. Yes, I can think about the thing. First, I, I like to do a series to give other women a voice yeah. and a platform to tell their story. It's a criminal series I plan. Yeah. It could be hundreds of, of what. It all is a horrible... Um, story. Every single one is is so frightening, and so they, the people will cry about if they read what this. Yeah. But now, if I met you, I'm going to make uh, something extra. I take you as a man. Others maybe all well, you've got a girls. Part. You've got a lovely part. Yeah, right? but he he don't have to write in my book. I think is <laughs> <not it. laughs> maybe maybe some more are coming because it we have to bring it to the world that there are so many of them and so they many. are all cut off their emotional centers this yeah. is the exactly. they, they don't yeah. have any nothing, nothing any feelings cheers guys this was a great interview with regina we can't, can't